Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we'll be watching the pilot episode of The Has Been Hotel. Now this show is just one of a bunch of shows that were recommended to me. I picked this one purely because I like the thumbnail. It's an animated show, I guess. Uh, I haven't the slightest clue what the show is all about, so this is going to be a completely blind reaction. The pilot episode of the show is on YouTube and the rest of it is on Amazon Prime. So the first episode of season one of the show is not the pilot episode of the show. Because apparently the pilot episode of the show was so good that Amazon Prime picked it up and uh, developed it into an entire season. And that gets me excited for this show, for sure. So without any further ado, let's just dive right in. Oh, the pentagram. <laughs> all right, all right. It feels like a Tim Burton show. I mean, the intro does. Okay. Creepy. Welcome to hell. Wait, is this actual hell? Porn Studios. <laughs> Was she crossing it out because the person died? <laughs> oh my god. That was that was hilarious, yeah. One year for the next cleanse? What cleanse? We'll find out. I'm alive! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the fun time. Oh god. Stuff. You sack of poorly packaged horse shit. Tell the missus I said hi. Ancient dust. Wait, is that hey, what I think it is? Drag show. My drugs! Ah, uh, damn it! Of course. <laughs> Me with his What's with the gun. chicken sounds? Are those actual At eggs? Rate, <laughs> I will seize Why are eggs in hell? Side of the pentagram by day's end. What did they do? What did you just say to me, you fried chicken fetuses? Fried chicken fetuses? That was <laughs> boss, Mr. Boss Man. Good afternoon, I'm Katie Killjoy. And I'm Tom Trent. Katie Killjoy. That's right, Tom. After There's just so much going on right now. I can't read the scroll, but I bet, bet it's funny. I'll read it later. Looks like they're fighting tooth and nail for that hot spot. Tooth and nail. And she ate those. <laughs> you are a lip dick jackass, Tom. Or should I say, no dick. Coming up next, we have an exclusive interview with That's the daughter of Hell's own head honcho, who's here to discuss her brand new passion project. All that and more. <laughs> <laughs> He's still in pain on camera. Oh, God. Yes, let's do this. Just All right, Princess of Hell. Come on, Vaggy. I know what to Vaggie. say. I just feel like we need to. Her name is Vaggy. No, make things sound more exciting. I have so many thoughts <laughs> and questions. The highlighted bits are the best parts. <laughs> the squeaking uh, it's sounds. All highlighted. Yes, that's the happy ending. See? What? There's nothing highlighted on that one. Okay, fine. She's gonna sing, isn't she? Just have to result to my impeccable improv skills. Improv skills. Hi, I'm Charlie. Trying to Maybe be British, are we? I can't do it. I'd no. Say it's a I don't touch the gaze. I have stared. Okay. Yeah. Homophobia. I mean, it is hell after all. My time is money, so I'll keep this short. You're not here because we wanted you here. Why is she poking her boobs like that? Didn't she say she hated gays? As most of you know, I was born here in hell, and growing up, I always tried to see the good in everything around me. Hell is my home, and you are my people. We we just went through another extermination. So, I've been thinking, isn't there a more humane way to hinder overpopulation here in hell? Perhaps we can create... So hell is overpopulated? Souls through redemption? Makes sense. <laughs> a hotel that rehabilitates sinners. Ah, uh, the has-been hotel. Gotcha. You know, because hotels are for people passing through temporarily. <laughs> <laughs> is this girl... 
<laughs> Nobody has any faith in her. She's not confident on camera, damn it. Oh man. Maybe I'm not getting through to you. Oh no. Oh, she's gonna start singing. I'm probably gonna have to mute the song on YouTube, so I mean that's just the way it is. What was that transformation? The dogs in hell? No. Not possible. I'm loving the song, by the way. Damn, that's good animation. Oh my god. She put on that show in the studio. Wow. <laughs> that was Makes you think a single denizen of hell would give two about becoming a better person. You have no proof that this little experiment even works. You want people to be good just because Angel Dust? The porn star? Oh, he's a porn star? Oh, that's why he's so horny. Gotcha. I'm sure you can get that hooker to do anything with enough sugar sugar and lube. <laughs> oh, I beg to differ. We are receiving word that a new player has entered the ongoing turf war. Let's go to the live feed. It's gonna be him, isn't it? Yeah, there you go. It looks like the one who just joined the battle is none other than porn actor Angel Dust. What a juicy coincidence! You must feel really stupid right now. <laughs> Don't look at this. She was trying to block the view. <laughs> oh man. How does it feel that I got your pen, huh? Bitch. <laughs> Oops. All right. Are they actually fighting someone or, the, or are they just causing chaos? Oh, they're fighting these egg guys. Oh, harder, Daddy. Son. Kinky. Oh, not like that, pervert. Not so cocky now, are we? You know, you really gotta watch what comes out of your mouth. I've been making these sex jokes the whole yeah. time. Yeah. Oh, they're all going against each other. What? 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 Why do they look what? like what? cats to me from certain angles? I owe my girl buddy a solid. Isn't that a redeeming quality? Helping friends with stuff? Not no. with turf wars that result in territorial genocide. Eh, oh. You win some, you lose a few hundred. <laughs> a few hundred. <laughs> it wasn't that bad anyway. I made you look uh, sad and pathetic. Not helping, dude. Yes. Don't get your taco in a twist, baby. Was that you trying to be sexist or racist? Whatever pisses you off more. Ah. Uh. Would that make me double dead? <laughs> We're exactly doing yeah. to double hell. <laughs> I mean, aren't they killing each other? But me, bitch. Get used to it. <laughs> Listen, who cares if some jagoffs got hurt? Most of them are ugly freaks. Look around. You got a bunch of harlequin babies down You're here. You're one to talk. Hey! This body Harley Quinn. Oh yeah. Everyone wants some of me, and I got the creepy fan that is to prove it. The style kind of reminds me of that as well. <laughs> Show me your feet. Really uncool, you know, Angel. Hellphone. I like these small details. Why are there eyes everywhere? This was on YouTube. The animation is just insane for YouTube, by the way. Excuse my sudden visit, but I saw your fiasco on the picture show, and I just couldn't resist. Picture Why show? Why I haven't been that entertained since the stock market crash of 1929. <laughs> 1929? How old is this guy? And I'm not gonna let you hurt anyone here, you pompous, cheesy talk show. 
He is not bothered. If I wanted to hurt anyone here, I would have done so already. Okay. That tells us things. This ridiculous thing you're trying to do. This hotel. <laughs> I want to help you run it. Ridiculous. He has absolutely <laughs> zero faith in Why this. Why does anyone do anything? Sheer absolute boredom. He's been around for decades, so I guess he's bored. Does getting into a fist fight with a reporter count as entertainment? For him, I guess, yeah. It's the purest kind, my dear. Reality! Reality television. Yeah. After all, of course not. That's wacky nonsense. Considered an investment in ongoing entertainment for myself. Only to repeatedly trip and tumble down to the fire. This guy has ulterior motives. Yeah. Then he broadcast his carnage all throughout hell, just so everyone could Loving this animation story. style, by the way. Sinners started calling him the Radio Demon. It's very Tim Burton-ish. The likes of which we can't risk getting involved with unless we want to end up erased. If he's that powerful, he probably has a lot of resources. Kind of double-edged sword. It's pure evil. He can't be redeemed. <laughs> he's always he smiling. I love his character design though. I mean I like all character designs, but But the whole point of this is to give people a chance. Oh, are those our parents? Things will be better. Do not make a deal with him. Don't worry. A literal deal with the devil, huh? Thing from my dad. Okay, so now you're sketchy as fuck and you clearly <laughs> see what I'm trying to do here as well. <laughs> He's always smiling. <laughs> so it's a deal then. I guess she's taking the deal, huh? Nope. Oh. No shaking, no deals. Hereby order that you help with this hotel for as long as you desire. <laughs> oh my god. Sound fair? Hmm. Fair enough. Okay, he's taking the deal. Oh, oh she's the only you staff. Really need more than that. And what can you do, my effeminate fellow? I can suck your dick. <laughs> No, your loss. Oh my god. He's always horny. Okay, we have fire. What is that? It really needs a lady's touch, which is weird because you're all ladies, no offense. Oh my gosh, this is awful. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh my god. Hell, what Wait, the fuck is this? He just got transported. You. Job. Well, I figured you would be the perfect face to man the front desk of this fine establishment. Really? Such a grumpy guy on the front desk? Welcoming energy, this job I mean, was made for you. it happens. It happens. Oh, cheap booze. Well, you can. <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> Only if you watch me. Oh my gosh. Welcome to the happy hotel. He's always so horny. Oh, I was not expecting a song at this point, but... I love the fact that he can just conjure up demons to do whatever he wants. We meet yet again, Alistair. Do I know you? Oh my god. Oh god, those poor eggs. They just get splattered everywhere. Alistair is powerful as F. It's over in well, literally I'm seconds. Who wants some jambalaya? My mother once showed me a wonderful <laughs> recipe for jambalaya. In fact, it nearly Oh my god. <laughs> we got a name change. Has been hotel. Well, that has been great. Man, I love the music in this show. It has like this Disney feel to it. I cannot believe that this was done by like an independent group of people. This is insane quality for you two. <laughs> will you shoot me with your ray gun? Oh god. Alistair just ruined that guy. Alright guys, so that was the pilot episode of the Has Been Hotel. And man was that episode amazing. This is definitely one of the most innovative shows that I've seen in a long time. There's actually a lot of stuff to unpack in this episode. First of all, I'm a millennial. And the animation style of this show straight away transported me back to the uh, 90s, you know, style of Cartoon Network and stuff. 
there was something about the animation style that felt like it was done in the 90s and i'm just watching it in 2024 it was exciting for sure it brought back a lot of nostalgia for me and then the music there were i believe two or th I, I think there were three songs and i loved each one of them i was not expecting a show on hell to have such a bright color palette and such upbeat songs but here we are and it works so perfectly for the show the animation style the look of the show and just about everything was so beautiful looking it was one of the reasons why i picked this show to react because the thumbnail was just so eye-catching and appealing that i just had to click on it i'll be honest if i didn't have to react to this show i would have binged this show in like I don't know, one or two days. I haven't actually checked the show on Amazon Prime, so I have no idea how many episodes are there in the first season. But to be honest, if I didn't have to react to this show, I would have probably binged them like in, in a day or two, maybe three days, depending on the uh, number of episodes of this show. But thank you for watching it with me, guys. And if you like the reaction, please leave a like on my channel. It helps me to grow my channel and subscribe to my channel if you can. Uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.